Okay, YouTube, what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a silicone mold. This was attempt one. It did not work. I waited too long. It started working, and boy, it does smell like vinegar bad. Okay, first thing you do is water. Put some Dawn dish soap. You're gonna want quite a bit. Um, I don't know if that it has to be Dawn dish soap, but that's what uh, the research I did said to use. So, okay, and you want to stir it around a little bit. You don't want to stir it too much to where you get bubbles, but you know you want. Then you take 100% uh, all-purpose or. It's 100% silicone is what you want. It doesn't have to be that. I got this from Walmart. And then you just start spraying it in there. Um, and you got a work time of this. So we're going to use about half of this. And yes, you, you do have... A limited amount of time to use this you know uh, I think yeah, it's right around 20 minutes and it's gonna be hard so but you want to let it sit for a little bit and you want to let it to start get white you don't want to uh, just you can just start messing with it right now but it's gonna be basically really 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 stringy and I guess what you can see is you'll, you'll just yeah it, it won't stick together it, it won't want to stick together but uh, you just leave it alone and let it sit for a little bit um, probably four minutes yes yeah, probably you know four minutes Maybe, maybe three minutes, you let it sit, and then you can start working with it. Anyways, it uh, starts to turn white, and you can start clumping it together when it starts turning white. Once it starts turning white, that means that it's activating, and uh, you only got a limited time to work with it. So you want to definitely hurry up. Work. Yeah. It's starting to, it's going together. You want to work it together to where it's all one piece. Just knead it a little bit. You want to dunk whatever you're using in something so you get some uh, soap on it. Because if you don't, it ain't going to come out. So I'm going to have to use more because I don't think I have enough, which is fine. Push that down in there. Get. Ah, not on the table. Some of that to go down in there. I think, I think that's probably good. So we're going to let that set, and we're going to let that dry, and uh, we'll be back when that sets and dries. All right. So what we got here is we got our molds. We did several of them. I didn't do them all on camera. This is the one I did on camera here. Um, it worked out pretty well. It, uh, I definitely could use it. I mean, it's not that bad, but I wanted to try again. You know, because I would have had to clean these up and stuff like that, which is not that big of a deal. Um, this was all pretty decent, but it, I think this was due to me. It having a few spots that were messed up here, I think it would be fine. Uh, but anyways, this is the one from this mold, and it's much better. I had to do very little cleanup. You know, I just cleaned up in here a little bit, and... A couple little spots on the side so that's the one we're going to use next thing we do in this uh, process is we are going to mix up some plaster of Paris in our sailor jerry cup um, spice rum Woo. I don't even drink uh, 
I just got the cups. You don't have a whole long time to work with this stuff too. It will start setting up on you. Oh yeah. A lot more water now. Alrighty. Now, let's just pour some in our mold here. And then we want to set our part in here. Doesn't have to be perfect straight because you want to leave a hole, which it's pretty thin right here. So I'll just break off these parts right here. Um, you want to leave a hole so you can burn that back out. So. Alrighty, it is what it is. Attempt one. <laughs> hmm. Alrighty, well, uh, we'll come back when that's dry and to show you guys to <clears throat> go ahead and burn out the wax uh, so we can have a mold for casting aluminum. Alright, stay tuned. Keep watching.